Today marks five years since that violent tornado with winds up to 165 miles an hour tore through Appomattox County. One person was killed and several others were hurt. It's a day Chief Meteorologist Jeff Hanowich remembers well. I remember traveling to Evergreen the day after the tornado. Upon entry into the tornado ravaged area, my photographer and I were totally speechless. With the exception of the occasional, oh my gosh, no words were spoken for a long time. When you are on air tracking severe weather, in your mind, you are hoping and praying that the storm is behaving itself, that it's not doing any damage at all to the communities you are talking about on TV. Before we arrived in Appomattox County, we knew that was not the case, but the pictures we saw prior to our arrival did not do justice to the amount of destruction that was left behind. My family lived in Kansas for several years, so unfortunately, I have dealt with tornadoes for part of my life. And the scenes from Evergreen were like what I saw in Tornado Alley, not Virginia, except they were in February of all months. After looking at the damage for a while, we then started talking to those who were so impacted by this powerful tornado and came across literally hundreds of folks doing anything they could to help out. I remember meeting the Appomattox County High School softball team as they were cleaning up debris left behind. When you have natural disasters like this hit, the community always comes together. The worst that Mother Nature brings, brings out the best in humanity.